Hey guys, so I wanted to do a video on this real quick because I couldn't find anything anywhere on the internet that uh, specifically covered blend spaces. I mean, uh, blend profiles, my bad. Everybody talks about blend spaces. But anyway, so if you're looking at a uh, state machine, you'll notice that you can select a blend profile and uh, the ALS character uh, actually uses this quite frequently. They don't use it for the ragdoll, obviously, but I was just pulling that up to show you. But a blend profile is set for the skeleton. And uh, basically, if you select this, if you go to your skeleton, you can create a new profile, a new blend profile, and you can set the values. For example, on this one, he set the thigh to 5, calf to 5, so on and so forth. And uh, he uses those inside of his animation to specify how it blends these, uh, these bones together. And I just want to show you this because I think this is ridiculous. This is literally the only information upon several searches I could find anywhere on the internet period in regards to blend profiles this is just ridiculous if you come to the uh, unreal documentation you'll see that they basically as always give you nothing that helps you except very uh, vague data but this at least let me know that it was bone specific to the skeletons this gave me no information. There's only two questions on blend profiles anywhere on their forums. This was the one, though, that uh, tipped me off right here where he was talking about inside of the skeleton thing. So I went over here and I realized that this is where they hide them. Well, not really hiding. It's pretty much in plain sight, but anyway. Yeah, so I hope this helps somebody. If it did, like down below and subscribe and uh, have a nice day.